Hi friends, I am recording this video on the topic the scope of mechanical engineering jobs in USA. Yeah, I met a gentleman on a weekend in Michigan and if possible, if I am able to drive back to Michigan, Detroit, Michigan, if I get an appointment with the gentleman, probably I may take a video interview of him and I talk to him like how he has come to America and then what are all uh, career experiences especially he is from the B.Tech mechanical background in India he has studied in uh, Jawaharlal Nehru uh, Technological University it's called J N to you subject he approached he came to Hyderabad in the year 2000 I'm speaking uh, before 2000 and then he went to Sachim Technologies Sachim also have an outsourcing of mechanical automation jobs understand right so then he get into Sachem and he came to USA in the year of 2000 he worked for uh, US clients and later when Sachem uh, was collapsed and uh, taken over by Tech Mahindra then he moved to another uh, supplier and then he got a green card uh, citizenship whatever and now he's working a full time uh, job with a US client and I ask him uh, because I explained how IT uh, Indian means and all these are corrupted and the hiring managers and delivery managers of Indian companies also takes money and then do you take money or uh, do you find fake resumes and all and then he was surprised to know you know what's a fake resume in mechanical field and he said it's not required and he heard about IT but he's not uh, no truth that much like I explained and he is and fortunately I asked him are you a hiring manager or hire people then he said yes and he is honest he doesn't take bribes like others and then uh, that's what and it's very fortunate to meet him then I said I will forward any queries or um, re resumes that I receive remember I am not from any educational placement consultancy I am not from any uh, placement agency so I don't need any money, I don't need, but the candidate must be born here, US citizen or he must have a green card. Because the US clients doesn't do, don't do this uh, H1B sponsorship for mechanical especially. Indian needs of course they never do or subject question, they may not do. And H1B is meant for all skills which are not available locally. That is the US law. Then you have to bring in. Uh, that is glass very clear man. That's what, and then when it comes to uh, forward of questions or whatever, then he must be a citizen or a green card holder. Then he can take an interview. That's what he told. And then, uh, in case if they need a sponsorship, it's one be like for example, masters mechanical or somebody studying B.Tech mechanical in India will have an insight. Oh, this is how somebody went, and all that. That's the purpose. I'm recording it, not for any other reasons. And MS Mechanical, then you can approach suppliers, they are not from Indian links, they are different from the Indian links. Suppliers will do the H1B sponsorship and then they will put you and uh, especially in Michigan area only, they have from this automobile mechanical industrial area, right? Uh, that's where and uh, I am really telling you, you have to do hard work. Hard work means not carrying weights. For example, in uh, NYNJ project was asked me to uh, carry um, 2000 sorry 250 lbs uh, weight of uh, sand in my truck or uh, servers and then I went to Ultrade centers JFK airports and all uh, in spite of having two disks I'm giving example because carrying heavy weights is hard work right even then my fortunately I come across a good American colleague there he told uh, it's all mindset Kumar you can carry that's how I carried all alone by myself and removed because getting entry for one person is very tough right so you can't uh, get another person for lifting weights so you don't need to do that much hard work that's what I'm giving this example all you need to do is sit in front of laptop explore identify says continues and you don't need to rep send resume to everybody and beg for a job or uh, somebody many guys they say I will give money you don't need to give money if you are giving money means you are you, you are worthless somebody is taking money means to give you a job means 
is double worthless. Both are thieves, according to me and USCS. Don't give money, study, search online. Like I met this gentleman, right? I will get his video interview if possible. I will ask more questions. So you can also send me the questions. I will forward it to him. And that's all. That's it. I wish you good luck. I hope this video is very informative to you. I wish you good luck. Those who are having B.Tech mechanical branch anywhere, either here or India or anywhere outside America, MS or Masses mechanical uh, students, this video will be very useful. I wish you good luck and God bless you.